refrigerators. It's not that we just can't do it. Just really cool stuff. Uh, I don't know. Really, yeah. I got solar panels on the roof now. Yeah. The mini splits one full black. That's not cool. What? What? Or triple. I just got to show you. Yep. Okay, so I guess we need to start this on because as soon as we start, as soon as we get out of here, yeah. Oh my god. I don't think we want to start. We're afraid. Okay, so it is uh, seven uh, seven oh four. We call our town council meeting to order and we rise the United States of America. Again, but I will right now unmute any everyone and anyone who wants to speak um, can be recognized by the um, mayor. Thank you. Okay, so folks, we are on our uh, audience of citizens. So if you have any uh, feedback for the council on whether it's tonight's agenda or whether it's on anything, uh, you must take a look at it and talk about it. And I will be and as best I can. Uh, uh, handle this through our, our remote meeting here. So, if anyone wishes to speak, I would like to speak. Yes, please. If you identify yourself and your address, um, Christine Doyle, 103 Fairview Drive, otherwise known as Tina. Um, I'm speaking um, as behalf of the senior center director and also the municipal agent for the elderly for the town of Berlin. I just kind of wanted to give the council an update as to. Um, what we've been doing the past 18 weeks in caring for our senior residents during this um, isolation period. Um, we have grocery shop for eight residents. We have done medication pickup. We have delivered a food pantry to a number of residents. I have delivered approximately 250 masks, which were donated to us by generous uh, resident. Um, I have set up meal delivery for 20 seniors in the town. Um, we have created what we call a gap squad. One staff and two senior volunteers call approximately 75 seniors each week that have either requested it or seniors that I felt could have benefit from the call just to check in and see how they're doing. We have also started a Jesus birthday Christ. parade. Come on sending birthday cards to our members starting in May. And I do a robocall every week. I have done it for the past 18 weeks, giving them senior center updates, town department info, COVID helpful hints and inspirational quotes to keep them positive during this time. We have received hundreds of calls requesting various help, everything from mental health resources, um, masks, tax aid, foot care, even purchasing of pants for a senior in need. Um, I have delivered everything from masks, large print books, puzzles, Dale Panera, fresh veggies, uh, flashlight, batteries, toilet paper, paper towels, groceries, Lysol Purell, Lysol wipes, and meals to seniors in our community. And I am currently working on a project to reach out to our isolated non tech seniors, um, hoping to have it out to them uh, by the end of next week, beginning of August. So I just wanted to update the town council and the mayor um, on what we are achieving at the senior center. And I just want to commend my staff um, for all their help in, in helping me get this done. So thank you. Well. Thank, thank you, Tina, so much. I mean, we uh, have, have tried to follow along as best we can with reports from uh, Roche and folks that talked to us. So we certainly appreciate all you've done. We know it's been a kind of a monumental task during this time. And uh, we appreciate all that hard work and 
do you need more resources? You know, I mean, do you need anything? Please, I know Roche has already talked to us about it, but if you need anything, don't. You know, and I know you won't, Tina. We know you well. I appreciate that. You know, we, we won't. Uh, you know, let us know. Don't be shy, and I know you're not. So appreciate all, all you've done. Tina, thank you, Mayor. Tina, thank you. You're amazing, and I know that you do all of this with uh, minimal. Uh, staff and very few volunteers so thank you so much you're incredible thank you joanne okay so uh now anyone else wishes to speak uh, at the audience of citizens uh, i would like to if i could yes sir uh peter defazio 92 wildermere road berlin uh, uh how you guys doing good, good. hope you're all well thank you um so you know that, excellent. As you all know, um, hard times are upon us. That's no secret. But um, the commission uh, sent out a letter on June 19th to the entire Timberland maintenance staff, golf shop staff, and restaurant staff. And I'd like to read that letter that we did send uh, to them. And this is from the Golf Commission dated June 19th, 2020, from the Timberland Golf Commission. And it reads as follows, on behalf of the entire Timberland Golf Commission, I would like to express our sincere gratitude and admiration for the amazing efforts over the last few months during these unprecedented times. We appreciate everything that you have done to make Timberland a safe environment for the golfing public, as well as each other. The professionalism that you have exhibited has been spectacular. We, along with all of the golfers, appreciate your hard work and dedication and we thank you for going the extra mile. Best regards, Peter DeFazio, Chairman, Timberland Golf Commission. So, um, the, the, you know, the, 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 everybody's wearing masks, everybody's practicing social distancing. Uh, we've had nothing but compliments from golfers from out of town, from in town, residents, non-residents. Um, so, you know, we're pretty we're pretty proud of the fact that we were able to stay open and and, and generate uh generate some some revenue during these times and speaking of revenue i talked to kevin today and um the golf course actually made money this year to the tune of sixty-two thousand um in the black and we'd also like to commend jonathan and his staff for saving um seventy two thousand dollars of their budget so uh a good job all the way around um and also on your agenda uh, later on, you are going to, uh, we're going to speak about the Timberland golf course cost reductions. Uh, you guys had asked us for uh, ways to reduce costs and the agenda says recommendations. And I want to make it absolutely clear that those are not recommendations. Those are merely options. The golf commission does not recommend any of those. We just we, those are just options that, to, to be presented so that you can ponder um, because you asked us to, to how, how you guys can save some money in the golf course and these are the options. So I just want to make that clear that these are not um, our recommendations and we all stand behind that. The whole commission is unified in that regard. Okay, thank you. Thank you, Peter. You're welcome. Um, and, you know, like to Tina, to, to obviously the golf course, to from a road to everyone in town hall, I think we I think we mentioned it at one of the past meetings. You know, everyone in town hall, like, please, please, talk to whoever really we, we got through at least part of this. We don't know it's yet to come. Let's hope it's in because it was in Connecticut anyway. Um, everyone did a great job. The town staff, uh, everybody worked together, and I, I really. I don't think I received any complaints about not being able to access the town service or from anyone that said they couldn't get a home at the town hall. Um, so, yeah, you know, we're at the golf course, and we're obviously the senior center. I mean, every, everybody is. It's, it's, it's town wide, and everybody did a great job. So, good to hear. Uh, anyone else wish to speak to our answer, citizens? Okay, hearing no one else, we'll go ahead and close the audience of citizens. Yes. Mayor, I apologize. We are having trouble with the video. That's what I just somebody texted me and said they're it's yeah. freezing up yeah. on. So yeah. we need to shut down and restart. Okay. All right. I apologize to anybody who has joined, but I'm gonna close the program and restart it. 
All right, so All right, we'll so uh, take a quick recess then while you do that. I have you have to call back in? Yeah, you got to call, yeah. everyone's got to call back yeah, in. They know that? So everyone needs to either click to join the meeting again, or if you are calling in, you need to call back in. All right, so just if you could all hang up or disconnect, and then I will shut down the program and then restart it. Thank you. Very well. Take a short recess. Take that long. Oh. That happened. Thank you.